from 19th of May, we will start to bring back students in small groups for face-to-face -face lessons. Uh, we will focus initially on the graduating cohort that are taking national exams. And so priority will be given to those who require school facilities for their coursework and practical sessions and those who need additional support during the school vacation period. The institutions of higher learning, particularly the uh, ITEs, will also bring back small groups of students on campus for critical consultations, projects or practicums. We've highlighted that we are focusing on the graduating cohorts of students who are taking national exams this year, and so naturally there will be a bit more anxiety amongst this group. And even within this group, we are not bringing back the entire group back. We are focusing only on those that uh, we are giving priority on th for those who require school facilities, for coursework, for their practical sessions, who need additional support and remediation during the school vacation period. So it will be a small group. We will do it um, with safe distancing measures, safe management measures, so that when the students come, we keep them in separate groups within their cohorts. Uh, we are not opening up the entire school system at all. all right? So it's done, in, again, in a very gradual manner in the month of May. And then from June onwards, we will think through depending on the situation then, how much more we can open up and how many more students can come back.